What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We are about to get into Krishan Rock. Uh, first of all, we're going to get into her Jason Lee interview and, well, that little snippet they got. And then we're going to get into her tweets and Blueface's tweets about last night. All right, so let's yeah, get into this. Yeah, it was this. so much tea. I didn't want to spill the tea unless I had to. I mean, in the office, you told me you might be pregnant. Because I said, because, you know, like, if they... Do you really think you're pregnant, like, for real? I'm fertile. I just had a baby. I know, but y'all just And he had, nutted. You just had... <laughs> so it was like... He what? Yeah, it's talking about this is my pussy. Uh, I'm being honest. I what? Jason Lee, what do you want? The tea? Clearly he wants the tea. Oh, my God. Well, I'm not surprised. Y'all know they never really used um, condoms or whatever. All right, whoa. What is that? Okay, so let me get to the tweets. All right. It's okay for you to do you, Papa. I'm just working, LOL. You got to chill. I invited you to come out. I would have made my boo stay home at his dorm. You constantly run knowing it's only hurting you, not me. Now, I like how she talking in that. Don't get me wrong, though. I'm still upset. It's like, what are we, Krishan? I, I love you. Anyway. All right. Y'all, I'm out traveling, getting money for Krishan Jr. This nigga blue is just somewhere lost. <laughs> You're lost. Keep getting me, keep getting at me like I'm forcing him to pretend to the world he's happy. The nigga just one of many niggas. I'm not the old Krishan when you used to ask those type of questions. When I live with you, boy, you got your life. I got mine. I'm not ever here calling you asking about your mess. I just vibe out with you because we got something here. But we just friends. Carry on, baby daddy. I love you, weirdo. You know, I'm starting to think when she told that nigga she loved him over the phone, she was running game. Oh, she might be running a little game. I be having hope for her. Stop calling. I've been falling back. The more you want fake love me is just going to hurt you because I'm going to do. I'm going to still do me. What y'all think about that? Um, It's giving she running game to me. How am I using you to sell tickets when I am the ticket? <laughs> That's what Krishan said. How am I using you to sell the tickets when I am the ticket? And you know what? While we on this video, let's get to this uh, $4,000 ring. Now, before y'all start, you know, and I'm talking about the people that's going to end up watching this video. Before y'all start, you know, trying to come at me, like you probably ain't even got $4,000. Listen, I want y'all to know that I don't sit in this chair for free. Okay. I, I I I do what I do and I get I get it in. All right. When I propose to y'all friend, that ring ain't gonna be four thousand dollars. Now the problem with that ring being four thousand dollars is not the fact that it was four thousand dollars. It's the fact that he clowned his mama about her ring. That was probably the same damn price. Now, why he would say that ring is four thousand or three and a half k at that? Not even four thousand. It's three thousand dollars, three thousand five hundred dollars. Okay. Why would you clown your mama about her ring, and you over here only paying four thousand dollars? You pay four thousand dollars for bottles of Hennessy. Then he lied and said it cost thirty k. Right. That's actually the main part of the problem here. He lied about the cost. Y'all, whatever ring I get y'all friend, it's gonna be a nice ring. And I ain't out here trying to go buy a $30,000 ring either. But it's going to be a nice ring. You know what I'm saying? And I won't be out here comparing prices to other niggas and they rings and they mama rings. And you know what I'm saying? And it didn't fit. That's why he won't show the appraisal price. That's crazy. I mean, but why go so deep to lie about it? And then for your mom, like, come on, bro. 
Bruh just be doing weird, weird, weird shit. But anyway, y'all, girl, this ring was $4,000, uh, three and a half to be exact. And I'm sure plus tax, it ended up being about 37 Um, Come to the store, please. I would like to place the order. And whoever did this, whoever messaged this person, you're a different type of petty and something is wrong with you. <laughs> okay. Um, let me get y'all back on the screen because I don't need a pain poking out. Uh, let me go to Blueface's tweets. All right. Jaden, wake up. They want to hear you rap again. I only follow my wife. I don't see half the stuff y'all see. I actually have a life for real. We was broke together. Now we having rich sex. So I guess he deleting his tweets, but it's okay. Y'all got me the tweets on Instagram. Shout out to y'all who be getting me these tweets on Instagram. Okay. Um, hold on. Let's get the tweets. Let's get the tweets. Oh, Queen and Clara. That's a really nice picture. All right. Where's these tweets at? Damn. So many of y'all send me stuff. Oh my God. Dollface. I'm in your messages right now and I'm so happy. I don't have it on the screen. Oh my God. Hold on, y'all. I got to get the tweets, bro. So, obviously, on the computer, it won't let me get them. So, let me stop this video forever for me to find these messages. But y'all wouldn't know because y'all, well, it's not in real time for y'all. But anyway, listen. So, we about to get into um, Blueface and his tweets last night. Let's make them a little. He said, itch got a pull-out couch in her mouth. Her furniture is effed. I'm finna call my jeweler. You want a troll for real? Watch this. Itch got dentures in for the rest of her life, thinking she can compete with my wife. Me and Jaden finna put her tooth on a chain since she ain't never gonna get no get back in real life, popping all that tough-ish online. Jaden is the real missing tooth bandit. <laughs> what? Like, what? I just went through all that for this. Okay, here's the pullout couch reference. Okay. Um, then he said, I changed my number before I proposed to Jaden, the only person with my number. Well, that's a lie. We heard you last night. Really? Blueface? This this is it? This is this is what you had to say? <laughs> that is cap. On cut come on, cud. That's my boo girl. I'm married. Get your girl, bro. Man, he one of the most jealous niggas I've ever seen in my life. Oh, man. <laughs> Yo, I can't believe I just did all that just to do that. But uh, that's why he deleting it. Yeah, because he know that that was some cornball shit he just did. Um, All right. So one last thing. He said something last night. Hold on. This is what he had to say last night to um, Rashawn, girl. Uh, I get it now. Nobody popped out to her little booking, her little show. So she, she desperately using me to, to sell more tickets. Come on, Kel. Come on. Uh, that's, 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 that's like what we resort to. Yeah, all right. Couldn't get nobody to pop out for you and for you at Mabu, so you, you gotta use me. You and your man can bring in the crowd, so we gotta come on, okay. This shit is. Ah, she I get sold it, out of gas station. Nobody popped out to her little booking, her little show. He a trip, so yeah. She, she desperately using me to to sell more tickets. Come on, Cal. Come on, uh, that's 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 like what we resort to. Yeah, right. you 
couldn't get nobody to pop out for you at, for you at Mabu, so you gotta use me. You and your man couldn't bring in a crowd, so we gotta come on, okay, this shit is. She sold out a gas station parking lot with twenty people. I'm convinced this boy might be a little bit bipolar. Just a little bit bipolar. Yeah. Um, that's going to wrap this video up. Hey, y'all, hey, Grace is here with her favorite black guy, her favorite Mandingo. They're, they're so fucked up. Whoopies, Yeah, Yikes. Hey, y'all, hey, Grace is here with her so we're going to get into that, too, because he was out last night with some uh, white women. Uh, so, yeah. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below, girl, because that's all we got. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Bye. All right, y'all. So it's more tweets than that. I know this video about to be all over the place, but I really don't care. Um, Let me get into these other tweets. Y'all just get what you will from it. All right. He said, I've never seen. Let me move myself. I've never seen a female more delusional record me on the phone, literally telling you, I don't F with you. You stop talking about me on live. That's literally how I talk to her every time. No sweet ish, no non like, how do I get this young lady off my meat? I tell you what, you take your meat out of her, her, her. You keep putting it in her. You was actually feeling some type of way about my boo. And I think that you think we just as stupid as them. And we not. Like, come on, boo. You got to do better than that, dude. <laughs> um, so at the gas station, I get it now. Nobody popped out to her little booking. So she desperately needs me to sell tickets to the next one. Am I the only person who's hearing this phone call? I don't care about no good news. No surprise. Stop talking about me. Because, like, what the F? This got to be harassment at this point. No, no, no. You actually said, I thought we was good, but now you outside with my boo. That's what I heard. Did y'all hear that? I thought we was good. I thought we was for lifers, but now you want to go make money and perform? Talking about me? That's what I heard. Yo, stop. This dude, crazy. Jaden, wake up. They want to hear you rap again. <laughs> Bitch, got to pull out couch in her mouth. Prashan said, I got the receipts. You just called me crying about me being out with my boo, which is facts. Girl, and then that's what, that's what made her expose the conversation. Okay. Yeah, this makes a lot of sense. Um, Y'all, I think that Blueface thinks that, that we're delusional. That's my whole point on the praying on women who either Krishan. Now, first of all, Krishan is definitely tripping. Um, I just hope that she running running game on him as well, because this is this is out of control at this point. Uh, what are we talking about here, Krishan? That boy don't he don't he don't mess with you. You know what I'm saying? At all. Um, however, he absolutely is in love with that vagina. <laughs> Literally. I don't think he loved Krishan at all. I think he loved her box though. And I, I think that thing hit different. That's why he can't get, you know, not even get rid. He can't get over it. He just give Krishan D. Yeah. And, and love, he love that, that. He loves something she do to him. He don't love her. That's for sure. She love him, though. She love him. That's the dumb part. No need to go to Jaden. No need to go to DMs of Jaden saying he loves Krishan more. And the ring was a publicity stunt. And she knows he still goes to see her. Where is that at? He loved the box and the money. Krishan said it, though. All they have is toxic sex. She did. She did. She said, we both don't really want to be with each other, but the meat is good. She's being honest. 
All right, y'all. I'm absolutely done with this. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.